Welcome to the spoken tutorial on arithmetic comparison in bash. In this tutorial we will learn equal to, not equal to, less than, less than equal to, greater than and greater than equal to commands. We will do this with the help of some examples. For this tutorial I am using Ubuntu Linux 12.04 operating system GNU Bash version 4.1.10 GNU Bash version 4 or above is recommended for practice. I already have a working example of arithmetic operators. Let me switch to it. I have named the file example1.sh. Open a file in any editor of your choice and type the code as shown. You must be familiar how to do so by now. In this program, we will check whether a given file is empty or not. Let me explain the code. This is the shebang line. First of all, enter file name will be printed on the console. Read command reads one line of data from the standard input. This command is enclosed within backtick. Backtick has a very special meaning. Everything you type between backticks is evaluated. Cat command will display the content of the file. WC will print new line, word and byte counts for each file. Hyphen W will print the word count. What will happen is, first the cat command will read the file. This is the input file, which it then piped or sent to the WC command. So, this statement counts the words in a given file. The output is stored in variable x. This is the if statement. Hyphen eq command checks whether word count is equal to zero. If the condition is true, we will print the message file has zero words. Fi is the end of first if condition. Here is another if condition. Here hyphen ne command checks whether word count is not equal to zero. If the condition is true, we print file has so and so words. Dollar $x will give the word count. And this is the end of second if condition. Save your program file. Let us execute our program. Open the terminal. First, let's create a file list.txt. Type touch list.txt. Now let's add a line in the file. Type echo within double quotes. How are you? After the double quotes, greater than sign list.txt. Now let us make our script executable. Type chmod plus x example1.sh. Now type dot slash example1.sh. Enter file name is displayed type list.txt. The output is displayed as list.txt has three words. Now let's learn about another set of operators. Let me switch to another file. This is example2.sh. Please open a file in your editor and name it as example2.sh. Now type the code as shown here in your example2.sh file. Let me explain the code. This program will check whether the word count is greater or less than 1 between 1 and 100 or above 100. We have a shebang line here. Read statement takes input as file name from the user. Here, hyphen C command is used to print the byte count. In the if statement, hyphen LT command checks whether word count is less than 1. If the condition is true, then we print no characters present in the file. If I ends the if condition, the next if statement contains nested if statement. First, hyphen gt command checks whether word count is greater than 1. If yes, then this echo statement will be executed. There are multiple conditions within this if statement. 
Here, in this if, hyphen ge command checks whether word count is greater than or equal to 1. And hyphen le command checks whether word count is less than or equal to 100. If both the conditions are satisfied, then it prints number of characters ranges between 1 and 100. Please note that both conditions should be true to satisfy the entire if condition. This is because we have included ampersand in between both the conditions. Fi is the end of this if statement. Then the next if statement will be evaluated. Hyphen gt command checks whether word count is greater than 100. If the condition is satisfied, we print number of characters is above 100. Fi is the end of if statement. Here we end the second if statement. Now come back to our terminal. Let us execute the program. Ch mode plus x example 2 dot sh dot slash example 2 dot sh type list dot txt the output is displayed as list dot txt has more than one character number of characters ranges between 1 and 100 now add or remove characters to the list dot txt file then observe which if statement gets executed this brings us to the end of this tutorial. Let us summarize. In this tutorial, we learnt equal to, not equal to, less than, less than equal to, greater than and greater than equal to commands. As an assignment, write a program to demonstrate the use of not equal to operator. Hint, hyphen any. Watch the video available at the link shown below. It summarizes the spoken tutorial project. If you do not have good bandwidth, you can download and watch it. The spoken tutorial project team conducts workshops using spoken tutorials, gives certificates to those who pass an online test. For more details, please write to contact at the rate spoken-tutorial.org. Spoken Tutorial Project is a part of the Talk to a Teacher project it is supported by the National Mission on Education through ICT, MHRD, Government of India. More information on this mission is available at the link shown below. The script has been contributed by POSI and Spoken Tutorial team. This is Ashwini Patil from IIT Bombay signing off. Thank you for joining.